Hey, it's Coolio if you don't know, and let's play Spelunky. Let's go! Starting once again from the top. Which is no problem, because that happens most of the time. Now, this is Snake Pit level, but I'm not sure if we're actually going to get to the Snake Pit. Whoa! Friggin' Potion of Polymorph or something. Oh, there's a snake pit. Eh, no point in getting in there, I don't think. Uh, I want that box. Do want. There we go. Uh, select. There. Ah, we got three ropes. Alright, let's just try to get our way over to level 5. Another... I don't think I've ever had two snake pit levels in a row. Oh, we got a machete. In previous versions, the machete was kind of useless, but they've definitely beefed it up since then. It's more powerful than the whip, for sure. I'll carry it around until something good comes up. Aha! Double kill! That is how you do it. Can I make that? Eh. Yes! Huh. Interesting proposition. Eh, not interesting enough. I don't think there's an escape route for that. I'll definitely bring along the damsel. There we go. That should get us safe and sound. I can get my machete and get out of here. Haha. -ha. Huh. Well, I can at least get to this box up here. And it contains a parachute. The parachute is a good item in theory. However, the fact that it deploys automatically is very unhelpful. Alright, on to level 3. I appear to be experiencing a ticking noise. I am worried that my computer is going to explode. Well, actually, it's probably the uh, timer program I use, but it's never ticked it before. Which is rather strange that it would now. See that? I didn't I did not need the parachute, but it still went off. Also, ow. Let's not try that again. Okay. Alright, drop the uh, machete. Oh, it's the key. Well, let's try to figure out where the chest is. Hopefully not too far away. Um, might be a little further away than I would have hoped. Uh, rope. Okay. Oh, there it is. Huh. How to get to it, though? That'll do it. There. Now, ah, rope. Aha! I just need to bump my way to the chest. And there we go. Ujet Eye. Okay. Now we can get... Did I just grab that gem through the... Yeah, that's kind of a bug. Let's see if there's another gem on the ground somewhere. There's one over there. And 
since we have a little bit of time left. Very little time left. Get my machete and hightail it out of here. Alright. On to dark level. Joy. Here's a brothel. Spoonie's Kissing Parlor. Yeah, great choice of name there, Spoonie. Spoonie McGee! <laughs> oh, fail. Let's bring along the entire freaking box. Why the hell not? Uh, I might want to open it now. So I can do this. Ah. Ow. <sighs> Freaking hell. But it's like I was saying though, as long as you're paying... There we go. As long as you're paying attention in this game, you won't die. As soon as your attention starts waning, then you start dying. Which is why you might see a lot of LPRs fail horribly at Spelunky. Come on, go down. Ah, screw you. Yeah, LPing splits your attention, basically. But you not only pay attention to the game, but you also have to comment. Which kind of screws you up. Oh, I almost had it. There. Gold! Uh, I don't think there's anything of interest here. Uh, once again, the, uh... Uh, Altar to Kali. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to offer it right now. Hey, it's Tunnel Man! He digs shortcuts. This guy is pretty useful, especially later in the game. You know how I say, well, sometimes it can be pretty hard to get through this game and you can't do it from one end to another unless you're a master? Well, Tunnel Man is the solution. Once you pay him enough money, He'll open a tether one. You can find him every four levels. Whoa! That was almost death. Not quite, but almost. I'm glad that it wasn't. That, however, was death. That's okay, at least we got up to town, man. And, uh, we're able to pay him off a little bit. About a quarter of the way there now. Okay, giant spider, no freaking problemo. Bomb! And run away. Haha! Hey, left a red gem. I think he might have left another gem too. Ah, I love my throwing items. It'd be very useful right about now. Oh! Well, at least I didn't get arrowed. Hey, random arrow shooting out there for no reason at all. That's just lovely. Complete miss, folks! Ha! Come on, die. Don't touch me! Yeah, that was my fault. I will blame that entirely upon myself. <laughs> yes! And that one goes off. I love this game sometimes. Of course, other times I completely despise it. Uh, maybe I can get a rock. Here and throw and miss. 
never mind. Actually, I should probably carry that rock over with me, but it's too late for that now. Alright, so next time on Spelunky, we uh, go over level 2 one more time. As if we didn't do so enough already. I'm Coolio if you don't know, and I'll see you guys next time.